What's going on guys? I'm gonna try something new today as a little experiment and see how you guys like it. I'm playing an online ranked match right now on Madden, this is a live commentary, and I just wanted to do a live commentary on a game, give you guys my inside thoughts when I'm playing the game and my reactions and see if you guys enjoy it. I know people enjoy my live streams quite a bit, but I hope that w if I do something like this I can kind of focus more on the gameplay and kind of tell you my thoughts during the game and it can still be entertaining and hopefully if you guys enjoy it, leave your feedback below by the way if you do enjoy it or just tell me your thoughts, whatever. And uh, I can bring them more if you guys do like them. So here we are in the game. Here we go, Leon Washington. I'm going to start on offense. I'm playing as the Seattle Seahawks. This guy wanted to be the Vikings. And lately, I really like playing as the Seahawks in this game. All right, you guys know how I am. I like to establish that run. But I hate when he plays so soft on the outside. I, I can't help myself. I just have to audible the quick slants all the time here. Here we go, Russell. Golden Tate. There's my seven yards. All right, the Vikings run defense. I know how good they are. That's no, that's no surprise to me. But I'm going to attack him. Here we go, beast mode. Up the middle. Come on. Ha. Ah, Kevin Williams and Detroit guy out in the middle. Chad Greenway fills. And it's a gain of one. All right, third down and three. Maybe Rice can get uh, some separation on this curl route here. But maybe I'll go to Zach Miller if he's open in the flats. All right, he's playing his own defense. And, oh, come on, Sid. <laughs> I shouldn't have even taken that chance, almost worked. Alright, now he picked the Vikings before I picked the Seahawks, so I picked the Seahawks because I think I can trust their defense against Adrian Peterson. We'll see here, he's going to run off tackle on the first play, and good job on the first play by Red Bryant. Browner and Sherman should have no problem against his receivers, although Percy has the speed. Alright, Ponder, let's see how you can throw over the middle, <laughs> it's overthrown. Ponder's accuracy isn't that bad, it wasn't 40 yards down the Alright, third and ten, I'm watching Percy. I like how we didn't put him in the slot, though. Also got to watch Adrian out of the backfield, because who's covering him? Bobby Wagner, he's got 89 speed, I think. Alright, what can we do here? Nobody's really open. Oh, over the middle, here we go. Oh, <laughs> Jenkins just drops it, so both teams put on initial position. Alright, I really want to attack him deep. I just don't have really a speed threat on this team at all, but maybe Sidney Rice one-on-one. -on -one. He's playing a single high safety. I like my chances here. Here we go, Russell. Oh boy, wide open. It's Percy. Uh, <laughs> Percy, I'm so used to the Vikings. Sidney Rice. Come on, Antoine Winfield's not going to cover him in bump and run coverage one on one on the outside. There's like a six inch height difference there. And Sidney had the, he had separation off the get go. All right, I don't, I don't really, I'm not scared of his receivers at all besides Percy Harvin. I know I don't really have, Sherman doesn't have the greatest speed. But I still, I want to blitz and see if I can rattle him a little bit because Ponder doesn't have great deep ball accuracy anyway, so I'm going to take my shots to get some pressure. All right, three on the right side, Simpson isolated on the left, and here comes the blitz. Wagner, and the blitz is picked up, and he rolls out. That worked exactly how I kind of wanted it to work. All right, I'm going to play press coverage on the outside now and see if I can hopefully delay him enough so I can get some pressure. But I'm going to man cover Adrian myself because I, if he runs an angle route, I know the computer can't cover it. And I'm always looking for like an angle route or a screen on third down. So I like to cover the running back myself. And he's just going to go out in the flats. Over the middle. It's intercepted Leroy Hill on Kyle Rudolph. Come on. Taken down at the 25. One of the things I really like to do when I get an interception or a turnover, or I just get a real big swing, is I like to go for the kill shot. So I got Tate and Rice going long. I'm spreading the field out. All right, here we go. Russell to the goal line. Touchdown, Golden Tate. That's that's the easy one this year because with precision passing, if you can get by and there's like a flat zone there on the cornerback or if he's playing bump and run and you can, and he doesn't get a good push off the line, that, that's money all day. The safety doesn't react fast enough. Marvin, Aroma, do Simpson, Jenkins. Only one of the guys, only one of those guys even scares me, but I'm also scared of Kyle Rudolph. Although we've done a pretty good job on him today. I'm going to do it myself. He's going to try to go long. Oh, no. My bad there. See, damn, I can't believe Rudolph doesn't really have that much speed. And Wagner does. So I'm surprised he got so much separation there. But I didn't do a very good job. So 62 yards. One of the things that I hate about these situations is that you always want to cover the middle. But the pitch, it works too well sometimes. Ah, oh, Jerome Felton's in the end zone. All right. 14-7. Let him get back in this game. All right. Only five in the box right there. I think I can test the run game now. Hand off. Beast mode up the middle. Oh, wide open. Come on. You got to stack the box better than that. At least play a 4-3. I come out in twin tight ends. You should not play in a, a formation like that. You guys know I love to run those play action boots. Here it comes. Russell. All right. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Oh, God. I got... Oh! Almost got out of Anthony McCoy. Oh, I got lucky almost twice. I just want to see what he does with his defense on this call. I'm coming out in three with a three tight end set. And, yeah, I think I can definitely run up the middle here. We got the blockers in place. Hand it off. Marshawn. Ah, 
Ran into my own guys and fell down, but it's all about creating the best matchup for yourself. All right, I like to watch Russell throw. Here we go again. Second down and seven. He shows blitz. He's not going to. Wide open. Oh, come on, Russell. You wouldn't miss that pass, would you now? Third and seven coming. All right. What I call a play like this is kind of like my safety blanket because I have two guys going in the flats, and so I call it a safety blanket because if he blitzes me, one of those guys is probably going to be open unless he's playing a zone and covers that zone. But here we go, third down and seven, here comes the blitz. We'll dump it off exactly how I like to do it. Robert Turbin, yes, to get the first down. That's, if I see the blitz incoming, that's what I, my first priority is in that play. All right, this is the type of play where I'd usually force an interception when I throw it to Ben Obamanu because I like running that wheel route like that. All right, third down and four, and he's gonna bring the blitz. It's wide open, Obamanu first down. All right, it's a simple shotgun run to Lynch now, trying to follow my blockers, but uh, <laughs> come on, I wish you were a little faster. Lynch gets tripped up on the ankles for a while. And you gets can't seven. play soft coverage like this. You gotta bring your guys in more. I'm gonna have Sidney Rice run a quick out. That's my hot read. Otherwise, maybe Doug Bowler on the other side. All right, he brought his guys down now. And I got the, the angle route right here with Marshawn Lynch. That, I, they really need to patch that route and make it easier for the computer to cover. I almost feel cheap. That's the way I like to operate my passing game. Short, effective routes and yards after the catch. Now we're gonna run the ball with Marshawn Lynch and run over Greenway and continue to plow our way forward and we'll get set. It really bothers me when people play as the Vikings and keep the purple pants on. I'm not even sure the last time they ever wore those pants. Third down and four, here we go. Russell, over the middle, wide. Oh, come on, Sydney, way to make it more dramatic than it had to be. Could have been a quick slant for a touchdown. All right, he, he's not covering Obama in the right way. I, I really wish I could run a corner route with him to the back pile of the end zone. But uh, the best I could probably do is that. I'll try it. Second down and goal. I trust him to get separation. Here we go. Fit it in. Obama new touchdown. That's because he had Jasper Brinkley right there. He's not going to cover a wide receiver. I'm just going to cover over the top of Percy Harvin. Not really scared of anybody else. Although he did beat me deep once with Kyle Rudolph. I'll have to watch if he does another tight end streak. And he may be doing it again right here. He's got separation with Percy, Cam Chancellor, come on, take him down, that's a good first down though, Cam 19. He's got the split back shotgun, and he's going to go to Adrian, and we can't knock it away. Okay, so his, his two big plays in the passing game have been simple streaks like that, that should be easier to stop. Alright, back to throw with Christian Ponder, over the middle, deep, and it still beat me, come on Trufant. All right, Rudolph's good though, I like him. Now I really want to play a cover three, but I don't want to play zone coverage just close to the goal line. I'll just take my chances. We're, I'm going to go away from what I said before. We're going to blitz somebody. I'm going to double cover Rudolph here manually, and he's going to go to the outside. Wide open is Michael Jenkins. Wow, that was bad. Touchdown Vikings. All right, Leon, let's see how fast you can run. Get some blocks for me. Break to the outside. Leon Washington, there he goes. We're not going to need any extra time to do a play. We're going to make sure we're on this clock out, too. 2, 1, 0, in for the touchdown. 28-14. That was a good way to extend the lead before halftime. Back to that Leon Washington touchdown quick. It's all about attacking the Vikings with your speed if you can. I don't have very many speed threats, but I picked them because of their defense mainly. But Leon Washington there, he showed why the Vikings struggle against speed. That wasn't a very... Impressive kickoff return, but it happened because he's just faster than everybody. Second down and eight now. He's going to go back over the middle deep. Come on, Cam. Yeah, we'll knock it away. Good range. I'm playing zone now so I can run a cover three and try to stop that streak by Adrian Peterson. I'll bring him down a little bit. But here we go. That's Earl Thomas in the middle. I like him playing center field. And this just opens up and stuff underneath, though. That's one of the things I'm kind of picking my poison right now. But it's fourth and inches. I think it's been a little while since I blitzed, so here it comes again. Especially if he wants to hit that streak, if I can blitz him effectively, it doesn't give him enough time to open that up, really. Uh-oh, run blitz doesn't work, and now to the outside. Oh, Adrian, wrapped up by Earl Thomas. Thank you. Making a ton of adjustments here, like Peyton Manning. And now, oh, I can read that play action from a mile away, and then Brandon Meebane will take him down. He had a man getting open, too. I think it was Rudolph. I didn't see who My it was. My entire thought right now is that he's going to go back to that tight end streak or something. Oh, no tight ends in the field, actually. I have no idea what he's going to do. I'll have Leroy Hill drop into his zone here. We'll blitz off the edge with Marcus Trufant. Bring down Earl Thomas. I think he can cover Michael Jenkins. Here we go. Trufant. Oh, boy. <laughs> That's why you need to keep in more than five guys to block on third down because if someone brings a blitz, you can get screwed.